Hey guys, this is Gabe Ramirez with another video tutorial. In today's tutorial, I will be going over basic Linux search commands. The first one, grep. The second one, find. This is just a general overview to get you going and get you uh, a basic understanding on how to use these programs or commands. So let's get started. <clears throat> the first one we're going to go over is the grep command. Uh, the grep command, it lets you search within files. Um, so it does a lot more, but this is the basic way I'm going to show it to you. So you type in grep, and I have already created a fi two files or three files in my home directory um, for this tutorial. So what you do is you type in grep, the next argument you type is the I. The I says search. So then tell it what are you searching for within a file a file or file directory with those three files I created two of them I added a keyword called content so <clears throat> that's what we're searching for we're using the grab command I mean search for the phrase the search string content where are we searching well <clears throat> we are going to search recursively so that's where we type in minus R lowercase r well we're searching recursively in a folder for what well we're searching for anything that is a text file so that's why we type in the um, double quotes asterisk dot text anything that's a text file the last argument is where are we searching for it well in my home directory so actually let's be more specific I'm looking for a file that has a word content within this home directory. You could actually, um, I'll break it down to you guys. The grab command, and the search argument, if this was a V, V would mean, instead of an I, if it was V, it would say exclude the word content when searching. But in this case, I means search for it. So you have I searching for, and this is uh, what you're searching for right here. The next command is minus R means recursively look for this tech this right here. In this case, it's this text file, anything that's a text file within this home directory. So that's how you kind of break it down. So when they, we hit enter, um, <clears throat> first of all, it searches recursively. So the first error or the first message we get here says grep. Uh, no such file or, dir or directory, that's fine. But it did find two. You see, file two and file one actually have the word contents within them. So it found it. So that's a basic use of the grep, grep command. If you want more information, I'm going to share some links below the video and on my website. Now, the next command, as you can see, we have two files called file one and file two, is the find. So we type in find. And then after find, the next thing, the next parameter it requires is find it where. Well, in this case, I'm going to search within my home directory, within eh, just my home directory. So find within my home directory. Then we're going to search for a file name. And the file name, well, you give it the file name. I'm looking for this file, file1.txt. There he goes, it finds it. But say if you don't know the case, maybe you think it's a capital F. Well, it doesn't find it, even though it's there. So how you take care of that is in the in one of the arguments that you could introduce into find is the I, which means minus I name, means case insensitive. The, the I means insensitive, case insensitive. As you can see, it found it. But say you know it's a text file, but you don't know the name of it. So you want to search for all text files. So how you do that is <clears throat> you use a find command. What Search what directory you're you going to look for or look in. What are your arguments? Me, I personally just use minus I name. And that, I would say 90% of the time gets me exactly what I need. And then what are you searching for? In this case, we're going to tell it search for we add the wildcard anything that's a text file so enter so it looks for every single text file in our directory and that is a very basic very um, trimmed down 
example of how to use grep and find. Uh, for more information, as I stated, um, look at the manual, the Linux terminal manual. So type man and then what command you want, grep, for the grep manual. Or if you want to find, you type in man, find. Um, I will link, as I said again, I will link some um, links on the bottom of the video and my website that will help you um, learn more of the advanced commands. So once again, um, please share this video. You liked it, give it a thumbs up and uh, talk to you guys later.